Hey guys, what's up? Um, time for another part of my deep horror movie DVD collection. <coughs> and it's my Conjuring franchise set. Uh, as you can see, I don't have them all. I wish I had the Conjuring 3. Um, <laughs> it was epic and so worth watching in the movie theater well to me it is <laughs> oh god <coughs> sorry it was so worth it watching in the movie theater uh, <laughs> um, guess we should go with this first I have the Annabelle 3 film collection um the first one Annabelle Because, well, this one is the first and the second one are all on a one disc. Sometimes I don't like that. And then there's Annabelle Comes Home. We. Um, the first one I don't really watch that much, so. <coughs> Sorry. I kind of just ate food. <sighs> Stuck in the throat. <coughs> <laughs> Seriously. Anyway, I don't really watch the first one much. I hardly remember it. <laughs> so it's been that long. Even though I did watch it on the DVD as soon as I got it on DVD. I watched the first one, but then I watched my favorite one, which is the second one. And then I decided to watch the third one, and then I'm like, okay, let me watch them in order. And I'm talking about first, second, and third. But then I decided to just watch them in the proper order that someone on YouTube mentioned. And I'm like, okay. And then I'm like, let me get hooked up on my favorite one, which is creation. And then I'm, I'm like, let me get hooked up on my other favorite, which is Annabelle Comes Home. And, um... And I think the thing that still scares me about the Annabelle first one is the, um, of course, the suicide in the beginning, because <laughs> that kind of scares me is someone cutting themselves. Then Annabelle Creation, one of my favorites in the Annabelle um, trilogy. Um, <clears throat> I can't say how my experience was first watching it. I can't say that with any of the country movies except Country 3 and The Nun. I definitely have an experience with that. Um, as for. I. Well, Annabelle Creation and Annabelle Comes Home. I discovered them. Well, mainly watched them on YouTube, the scene, so that's how I got it on DVD, because I mainly got it from there, from YouTube. Thank you, YouTube. Um, my favorites from Annabelle Creation, like scenes and quotes and stuff. Um, oh man, that's hard. That's hard. Well, one thing's for sure, the, um, like, doing this bad scene skit creeps me out it creeps me out oh my god and definitely that went the hand thing like whoosh, with the um oh jeez that that creeps me out too uh, but man uh, she is so good at being possessed um the girl who plays Janet. Oh God. Um, when I repeat scenes on my laptop, um, <coughs> lucky. That's better. Um, okay. Um, uh, I think. Um. Oh, on YouTube, the scenes called "Get Help," and um, the other scenes are like found you and uh, I basically repeat them all the time well of course I have a purpose for that you know but 
But anyway, yeah, I just like them. And, you know, it's actually helpful when a creep allows that out. <coughs> mm, food. Or you could help me. <laughs> I don't know if that sounds right through the camera, but if I watch a scene multiple times, if I watch the scene multiple times non-stop, then it turns out good. <laughs> <coughs> hate meeting from people talking. Uh, and about creation, man. Oh, God. Oh, no, Annabelle and... and Oh wait, didn't I just talk about end of operation? Yeah, I did. A lot of jump scares. Yeah. Oh, my God. oh it's NFL comes home. I'm about to talk about another one of my favorites of Annabelle. Although I have a lot of trouble when I talk about the it fran oh, franchise, but this is the Conjuring franchise, so let me not get off topic. Um. Annabelle comes home, man. There is so much going on in that movie that it's like so many like up there cases, so many ghosts. Annabelle able to control them all. As for favorite like Xeno Crawl to me, I think the creepiest one is the te cursed television. Every time I kind of I, like fall for it, every time. I basically like, fall for it every time. I'm like, what's going on? What's going on? Oh, what's going to happen? <laughs> But yeah, that's like things from Annabelle Comes Home that still like the jump scares and stuff. <sighs> well, that's this. So, this I can't really say what my first experience was because I basically watched mom and dad watch this like almost throughout my whole life. They don't really watch it anymore, but I still do. Um, let me see if I can remember based on the pictures. Um, I just know that I really love these two. Um, I, man, it's so hard to tell because, um, like I said, I watched them watch it for years, so it's hard to tell what still gives me the creeps. Oh wait, that part, that part still gives me the creeps, and that one. So basically, the beginning. Can't say about this though. I can't remember, so I will probably have to watch the movie again, and then what? And then mention it. I might have to do that, like, watch the movies, and then give myself, give a update review, like, long time no watch, long time no watch review, like, long time no see, man. But this is a long time no watch. <laughs> but as for the country, three. Dang, it was so worth watching in the movie there, just like it, it chapter two was. Damn, my first two horror movies in the movie there. Jaws was supposed to be the third one, but some someone forgot on purpose. No, it wasn't me. It was not. It wasn't me. I did by accident at the. But at the last minute, I realized it. But nope, it wasn't me who did it on purpose. Nope. And I really wanted to go. <sighs> da 
have none. Oh jeez, so insane. This is insane. First watch it, there was a lot of jump scares. <laughs> um, if you've been on my TikTok, I believe I have it on YouTube. Um, this this one scene that I posted, and I called it best moment ever, and that was when I first watched the movie. Like best moment ever. It's when the nun, um, Valak, like just slowly appears out of the water, and then he's just standing on top of the water. <laughs> That's when I first watch it. I'm like. Best moment ever. <laughs> it was just insane. I wish that was another movie that I could have seen in the theater. I wish. <laughs> anyway, that's the video of the DVDs I aha uh -huh, movies on DVD, but country the Conjuring franchise. Um, there is a supposedly there's another one. The Curse of Bar, whatever the name is, but okay, bye.